today I'll share how to make pattern for straight dress. So let's begin. For pattern making we need paper, scale, measuring tape, markers and scissors. This is the measurement I'm using. You can adjust it according to your requirement. Length 38 inches, bust 32 inches, waist 26 inches, hip 36 inches, shoulder 13.5 inches, front and back neck 6.5 inches. These are the calculations we will need. Bust plus 2 inches of waist divided by 4. Waist plus 2 inches of waist divided by 4. Hip plus 3 inches of waist divided by 4. So let's make the pattern. This is the length of my dress that is 38 inches. Now I'll mark all the vertical points on this line. So firstly make a point at 6.5 inches. From this point go 7 inches downwards and make the point this is the waist point from this point again go 7 inches downwards and mark a hip point extend these points Now I'll mark burst, waist and hip measurements. Burst is 8.5 inches as we calculated earlier. Waist is 7.25 inches. And hip is 9.75 inches. Now join these points. Now for bottom, hip is uh, 9.75 inches so I'll take 10.75 inches for bottom, mark a point and join the hip and bottom. So the bottom is completed, now I'll mark the shoulder and neckline. For shoulder take half of the shoulder measurement. In my measurement shoulder is 13.5 inches so I'll make a point at 6.75 inches. Mark the same point on the burst line too. Join these points. From this point go 1 inches inwards, join these points. So this is the shoulder line, now I'll mark the neckline. Generally I take neck point at 3 inches but in this case I'm making neck little bit uh, broader so I'll take 3.5 inches. From this point take the depth of the neckline that is 6.5 inches and mark a point. From this point again mark a point inwards 3.5 inches. Join these points to form a rectangle. So this is the front neckline. For back neckline again take the depth of the back neckline which is same in this case so this is a front and back line rectangle now i'll make the neck shape so this is the front and back neckline now for shoulder i'll make the dotted curve line this is the back shoulder curve and this is a front shoulder curve From this point go half inches downwards and mark a point. Join these points. This is a shoulder slope. So the pattern is completed now. I'll cut the pattern. So I have cut the pattern. 
now uh, i'll trace it on the other paper so uh, trace the pattern on this paper so pattern is traced now i'll cut it too so this is the front of the pattern and this is the back of the pattern so this is a straight dress pattern hope you like the video thanks for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe take care bye